my God, we're getting close. We're getting close. Who built the dome? Oh my God, Corona, there it is. Excitement for the eclipse is reaching its peak ahead of Monday's once in a lifetime event. A new astronomer, Laurie Rousseau Nipton, has never witnessed a total solar eclipse. She believes it will be beyond her wildest dreams. For the majority of people, when there is an eclipse, the total of the sun that passes in the sky is excessively strange and beautiful at the same time. It's a bit inexplicable. It's not a day ordinary day. Rousseau Nipton explained that a total solar eclipse happens at a particular time when the moon passes between the sun and the earth. As the moon blocks the sun's light, it casts a shadow on part of the earth. A total solar eclipse is rare. Donc, gardez un œil sur votre environnement, sur ce qui se passe autour de vous. Il va se mettre à faire plus froid, plus sombre. On va voir ces ombres-là, on va voir la couronne solaire. Et puis, euh, ça va durer quelques minutes avant qu'on puisse voir le petit diamant, là, le, le moment où, encore une fois, là, le, la lumière du soleil peut percer <rire> et elle va, va, va se rendre jusqu'à nous. Et là, on remet nos lunettes. According to some experts, First Nations culture and traditions are deeply rooted in the stars. So it is no surprise that legends about solar eclipses have been passed down through the generations. There's a Cree legend. Uh, um, we have a character. Um, um, his name was uh, Chikabesh, and Chikabesh is a legend that is um, is uh, widely known in uh, within First Nations, the Crees, uh, um, west of us, uh, the Inu, uh, east of us, have uh, have this, have similar stories or identical stories of of Chikabesh. Jamie Moses is from the Cree community of East Maine, about 1,200 kilometers north of Montreal. He said that it was his grandfather that first told him the story of how Shikabish, a folk hero, once snared the sun. Could have been the eclipse at that time, when when um, no, when Shikabish, uh, snared uh, the sun. So that's um, well, that's a reference of some people uh, relating to um, the eclipse um, of having. Uh, middle of the day, having a, a, a nighttime in the middle of the day. Moses added that he hopes for clear skies in East Maine on Monday. It's a bit of a moment unique. It's a moment that we live in a community. It's something that we want to be able to observe and to be able to observe it together. After Monday, the next time a total solar eclipse will pass over Quebec won't be until the year 2106. Maricela Amador, APTN National News, Montreal.